Hey everyone, welcome to iOS Hacker. If you have ever had trouble airdropping files because your device wasn't discoverable, don't worry, I've got you covered. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to enable airdrop for everyone on your iPhone or iPad so you can send and receive files effortlessly. So let's dive in. Airdrop is a super handy feature that lets you wirelessly transfer files like photos, videos, contacts, notes, documents and more between Apple devices. But if your airdrop visibility is set to contacts only or receiving off, it can limit who can send or receive files. That's why enabling everyone mode can be really helpful especially when you are in a public space or sharing with someone new. To change your airdrop setting, swipe down from top right corner of the screen to access the control center. Then long press on this communications widget to expand it. From here tap on the airdrop widget and then select everyone for 10 minutes option. Alternatively, you can also go to the settings, tap on general and then tap on airdrop and select everyone for 10 minutes option. After choosing this setting, you will be able to receive photos, videos, documents and more from anyone no matter if they are added to your contacts or not. Remember, you can only enable airdrop for everyone for just 10 minutes. After these 10 minutes have passed, the airdrop setting will return to receiving off or contacts only. This guide will also solve your issue in which airdrop was seemingly not working as you could not see other users iPhone on the airdrop screen. Before we wrap up, a quick safety tip. While setting airdrop to everyone is convenient, it is a good idea to switch back to contacts only or receiving off as soon as you are done especially when you are in a public place. This prevents unwanted file requests from strangers in public places. And that's how you enable and use airdrop with everyone. If you found this video helpful, then make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more iOS tips and tricks.